Hi, so we're going to talk through the electric guitar parts for It's Already Done. Um, and these parts are really simple. You're actually going to be completely out until the pre-chorus after verse 2. Um, and then you're only going to have to know two different chord voicings. The first is uh, kind of higher partials that you're only going to play for the pre-chorus. So you're going to go through this progression twice, and that's the only time you're going to play these chords. Uh, you can start with the F sharp by barring on 6. Right there, the top three strings, and then adding uh, your second finger on the seventh fret and your uh, third finger on the eighth. Like that. And then slide your first finger up to seven. Then you got nine and eight here. And then keep your first finger there on seven, and you can use these three fingers to make an A shape for that E. So, Sounds too good to be true, but it's waiting right here for you. And like I said, those are the only times you're going to have to play those chords. So twice through that chord progression on the high partials, and then the rest of the song is going to be uh, big, beefy bar chords voiced the way that you would normally voice them. So here's your B, with your finger barred on the second fret. Your G sharp minor, finger on the fourth. Um, and then your E, I actually uh, like for this particular song voicing it in open position. I'm not usually a fan, but in this song I think that voicing really works nicely. Um, and then F sharp. But make sure your second finger is uh, there on the G string, so it's a major chord. And that's it. Um, so the chorus. <clears throat> it's already done. Already done. Love of a father. in the sun. So And every time you play from here on out, um, like I said, you're in on the pre-chorus with those high partials, and then the chorus and the bridge, you're just kind of sweeping changes on those big beefy bar chords, out for the breakdown chorus, and back in for that final chorus, again, with just big sweepy bar chords. Um, so you're not really ever strumming in this song, unless in full band it just doesn't quite arrive and you need to kind of ramp it up a little bit, but uh, you shouldn't need to, just kind of those, those sweepy changes are, are enough energy for this song. Um, and then in the tag, um, you'll want to end where the lyrics end. So the music continues on for a while, but you want to end a little bit. Won't you receive what he's already done? Bum, bum. And everybody else will continue to play uh, E to B, E to B, E to B a couple times. Uh, but you'll want to hit that on done, hit that B and let it ring out, and then fade it out just before the next E happens, and then just stay out for that last little bit. So, um, I've queued up the song, and uh, we're just going to play through it. Now, like I said, um, you're out until uh, the pre-chorus before the second chorus, the pre-chorus right after verse 2. Um, so, if you want to go ahead and fast forward this video, that's fine. Um, I'm just going to let the song play, just so that you have context for where you are. Come for trouble, rest for hurry, it sounds too good to be true, but it's waiting right here for you. It's already done, it's already done The love of the Father revealed in the Son So open your heart up to His kingdom come And won't you receive what He's already done Life eternal Part. 
Sparkles. You only get to play them once. Make it good. It sounds too good to be true. But it's waiting right here for you. going into the tag, you do play a G sharp minor. I played a B because I wasn't paying attention. Uh, but you'll hear the rest of the band will change to that chord too. Uh, it's just the normal deceptive cadence. So uh, G sharp minor instead of the B and then straight into the tag. And then when you hit the B on done, just kind of fade back out before that E comes in. And that's it.